This week, we are in Maine. Check out that bridge. Going to the wooden boat school. Patrick and I are going to build a boat. I can't wait to go across that bridge. Well, we've had our first night at the Wooden Boat School. We had a pretty good dinner last night, which was some kind of chowder, seafood chowder. And here's some pictures of that. And then this morning, we had pancakes. Here's some pictures of that. Now we're on our way for our first day. We had orientation yesterday. And it's gonna be a lot of fun. So we got our tools. Our kids down there. Let's go build a boat. There's our first two pieces done. And that down there. We are on our way. We get to try an experiment in class. How cool is that? Look at all them clamps. Oh, this is what we're building. It's gonna be so cool. We just built a skeg. Now we even know what it means. So this is our progress from day one. We got all our framework done. And tomorrow we get to use this piece and build the whole thing. So cool. Tomorrow a boat will be here. Today is day two of build a boat. Patrick's excited. Let's go build a boat. Today we'll actually have a boat. Yesterday we just had pieces. So let's put the pieces and make a boat. Yeah. This is what it looks like. That's what it looks like after. Oh, 
and we have a boat. I don't know what the next step is, but how cool is this? We got a boat. In the day two, and it looks like yeah. a boat. So freaking cool. Patrick says I need to go see the campground. So let's go. Let's go see the campground. Here at the wooden boat school. Big open field. Well, that's cool. They've got a an area for well, this is wide open. Man, we could have brought a camper. We got some people camping. There's the bathhouse. Super cool. This place is pretty awesome. That's the bathroom. They got a couple cabins. The bathrooms are really nice. I was kind of surprised. The bathrooms in there are better than where we're staying. And there's the freaking ocean right over there. Got the bottom of the boat on. We have to trace it out. Then we take it off and cut it to fit. It's looking like a boat. Traced it out. Now we get to cut the with the jigsaw and fit it on properly. Yeah, that was a this broke off as a boo boo, but they fixed it. Stay to the outside alone. I'm gonna go outside. Outside of that. Alone. Back on the floor, under the boat, again. You getting it, Patrick? Yeah.
boat's all ready for epoxy to glue the bottom off. And look, he has trace everything out. Tell our pieces, we'll have a put together boat here shortly. It's one of the many parts it's drilled and ready for the bottom. Patrick's ready to go. the beginning of day four. We gotta knock these off around this. It's all on there. Make it look all pretty. Oh, and we're cutting these things off. Everything's all sanded up. Ready to go. Now we get to fill all these holes with boat bondo. Didn't go too well when I was uh, in high school, but should be fun. Patrick's having a blast. Well, here goes nothing. Just started to put the seats in. There's the frame. For the seats, it's uh, epoxy in. Patrick's working on the nose. How's that coming, Patrick? Got a ways to go. And then the front seats in. Ready for fiberglass, uh, I think. Got this part in, seats are about to go in. These are in, we got a little boo-boo. I don't like that, but it's coming together. Of course I need my Jerry Rig Everything knife when I'm working on a boat. I wonder if we're the first ones to use a Jerry Rig Every Knife. Building a boat. The orange one's my favorite. We gotta get all this crap out of there so I can make it pretty. Got our rub rails on, our front pieces on, there's our seats. Awesome. It's lunchtime. 
Time to find our sandwich. There it is. <coughs> this is lunch. A cookie, chips, some mystery cauliflower, sandwich, lemonade, and Patrick's got Great. mystery cauliflower, chips, tuna fish sandwich, a plum. I'm gonna eat a plum. We put these on, we gotta take them back off. Then they're gonna go back on again. And we'll have a rub wheel all done. You ready, Patrick? And then lots of, lots of clamps. So next shot will be this thing full of clamps. Patrick doing the precision work. The rub rails are on. Boat's pretty much done. We got all of our clips on it. The middle seat's done too, but it's over there. That's pretty much the boat. This place is absolutely amazing. Well, this has been a room for the last week. That was my bed. That was Patrick's bed. And this is all the room that we had. No. <clears throat> we had a couple chairs, but it just held our crap. <laughs> you know, we never even used these. I haven't looked in here. I wonder what's in here. Nothing. And that's where we slept. There we go, at the, the wooden boat, boat school. A couple decorations.
Yeah, it's a, never slept in a triangle room before, but we did this time. I guess it's kind of like a diamond with the, uh, all these windows. Kind of sad it's over, but I'm leaving the room just as we found it. They have a washer and dryer for us. This is where you would come in and check in. It's all set for the next class on Sunday. And they had the sitting room. And a minor mystery for Patrick is this plaque. You have a little library. I guess every house has a, has a library. Isn't that cool? I need everybody's help. We are looking to find out who put this at the Bowden Boat School. They don't seem to know, but this was Patrick's unit and he very, very much would like to know and talk to them. And there's where we come in to check in to the wooden boat school. So anybody that uh, comes here, this is where you come to check in. It is not where all the, the other buildings are. The address that they give you, it's uh, about a mile beforehand. You just park down there and walk in this door. And that would have been good information to have for us. <laughs> Yeah, here's where you park. You drive down this road. It's on the same road as the uh, where all the, the magazine is made and everything. Just come down this road, and there's your parking lot. Then you walk in that welcome door. And there you go. Blueberries for sale. How about that? And this is where you park and you walk in and check in. But we're leaving. So sad. Cars all loaded up. This is the last day, the last half a day at the wooden boat school. Did you have fun, Patrick? Big time. It was awesome. I suggest anybody go here. You'll love it. Yep, we're going to go find our trailer and have our last half a day of class and start heading home. And here is the entrance to where all the classes happen. And it's the address that you're given to get here. So if you're bringing a trailer, you, you do want to come here first because you're not going to get your trailer into where you check in, that's for sure. It's down this little road here, down the hall. Or it's not down very far. Last day. <clears throat> Take all the clamps off.
all the boats. They were all built. Loaded up on a trailer. Now we're gonna tarp her and worry about getting home. <laughs> 